I'm gonna let you guys decide because you see Tesla also sells their own insurance and they don't price it like traditional insurance companies that use demographic averages. They actually price it based on your own driving behavior. Use the data that's captured in the car. In the driving profile of the person in the car, assess correlations and probabilities of crash and be able then to assess a premium on a monthly basis for that customer. The amount of data that is available with the customer's permission to use is not available in any other product or any other vehicle in the world. So this gives us a unique advantage in terms of information. The benefit of all this is that it allows Tesla to cut out the middleman and give you a lower rate, which we all want, right? If you want to pay more for insurance, you can, uh, but if you want to pay less, uh, please don't drive so crazy. Then people can make a choice. Like, okay, they want to drive aggressively in the case of your higher insurance. You're more careful in the driving and it'll be, be less. This all sounds great. It saves you money. And Tesla even offers that it saves lives because this data is also being used in full self-driving to help prevent accidents. But what if this data gets into the wrong hands? Think targeted ads. I mean, that's not too far off, right? Meta's already doing this. I talked to a friend, an ad pops up, and actually Jeep is already putting ads directly into their cars. So it's really not too far off, but what about government surveillance? I mean, that sounds pretty scary. 